I will never allow Namdekanus trial to hold. Namdekanus lawyer, Ejimako, declares. A lawyer, Ejimako, a lawyer of Namdekanu, leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, on Tuesday said the trial of the secessionist leader should be opposed but monitored. Ejimako said Kanu's trial should be opposed because he was illegally arrested and repatriated to Nigeria. Hence, there won't be any trial. The lawyer said the Nigerian government contravened international laws by illegally rearresting and repatriating the IPOP leader. He spoke against the backdrop of those saying they would monitor the trial of Kanu following his repatriation to Nigeria. The IPOP leader was rearranged before Justice Binta Nyako of an Abuja Federal High Court. Justice Nyako had remanded Kanu in custody of the Department of State Services, DSS, while adjoining the trial. Nigerians and foreigners sympathetic to Kanu had vowed to monitor Kanu's trial in a bid to ensure that the IPOP leader gets a fair trial. However, Ejimako faulted the decision to monitor the trial. The lawyer recalled the situation of former advisor to ex-president Shehu Shagari who was illegally abducted in the United Kingdom, UK, in 1984 by the Nigerian government. Ejimako, who likened Diko's situation to Kano, warned that Nigeria would suffer severe consequences as a result of the abduction of the IPOP leader. In a statement, he said Nigerian would answer to Britain, to the international community, and even to Kenya over Kano's illegal rearrest. He said lately some individuals and civic group have been some show of support for Mazin Namdi Kano, indicated that they will monitor his trial in the same vein. Some have also called for a fair trial. Fair trial of what? Illegality in high places. Why it's commendable that Kanu has attracted such avalanche of support across the spectrum. It's important to make it clear from the outset that there won't be any trial to monitor. None. Kanu cannot be tried on the basis of this extraordinary rendition that brought him to Nigeria. <laughs> On a fair ground, on a fair ground, to be sincere and to be frank, Namdi Kanu's trial is not supposed to hold. There is, n there is nothing like trial for Namdi Kanu that's supposed to come to play. I am telling you, nothing of such. So if any trial is to come to play. I'm telling you, it's going to be a foul trial. Okay, look at what the uh, 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 Malami was saying. Malami was saying that uh, uh, he's assuring the Ohanese Indibu that Nam the Kano's um, trial is going to uh, is going to be a fair trial. What about that? Who is asking him of that? He, so he went on to uh, to invite the Oranese Indibo to be the one to monitor the Namdekano's trial. Namdekano has never invited or asked any any, any Oranese Indibo to monitor his trial. He's not asking any of them because Namdekano is not having anything to do with any of them. Do you understand? It's not having anything to do with any of them any of them. So if any of them are coming in in to monitor them, they cannot try they are on their own issue, they are on their own. Because Namdekano is not inviting any of them. He's, he doesn't even want any of them.
that is just the fact about it so now this is uh now the kind of lawyer speaking saying that he is assuring Nigerian that Nam the Kano's trial is not going to hold on the 26th of July. Well, he, he knows how possible he's going to make that. Maybe he has uh, a means he's going to uh, use to make sure that that doesn't come to play. W one cannot predict that. One can predict that. It might, he might make it happen. So I don't want us to, you know, to to give him. <laughs> let's give him a penalty or any, a benefit of doubt, because if you look at it very well, you see that yes, of a truth, he's right. He's right, because Nigerian government abducted Namdekano illegally, and everyone is 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 uh is saying it that it is an illegal abduction. It is a criminal abduction. If you want to abduct someone, you abduct someone in a transparent way. The person you are abducting should be aware that you are abducting him. And people should be aware that you are abducting this person. And there should be a reason. The person should be able to know the reason why you are abducting him. That should, and there should be a, 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 an arrest warrant. But in the case of Unam Dekanu, none of these things came to play. So it's a criminal abduction. In fact, it's a kidnap. It's a kidnap. So if even if the, the trial must take place, the Nigerian government should first of all be be, be questioned on that. They, they should be charged on that. Do you understand? They should be charged on that. They should be charged on that. That is just the reality. So my dear viewers, uh, Ejimako has a point in what he has said. He has a point. So I don't know what uh, any other person is trying to say. I don't know what uh, uh, what the other people are trying to say concerning this, but to me, that is just the reality. So um, please, my dear viewers in the house, let me hear your opinion on this issue. If you, um, Don't forget to leave your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.